The Flock, the ultimate game of red light, green light. The Flock ends up being find the guy with the light bulb, take the light bulb, run around till you win. There is no excitement at all. Oh, I'm supposed to get my blood pumping when I have the light bulb knowing four monsters are chasing me down to take it? No, because it instantly kills them if they're moving, and it has unlimited ammo as long as I'm running, which I will be since I need to avoid them, since that's the whole goal. Like, that's the game. Grab light bulb, run around till the game is over. Hell, the scoreboard itself looks so bland, it's hard to tell you even won. They're trying so hard to build around this population mechanic, but the amount of kills it will take, the time, and the general lack of players, I don't think the goal will ever be reached. You can do everything there is in the game in about 15 minutes, 5 minutes per map, which is only 3 of them. And during those maps, you start off as a monster. You grab the light bulb, get a few kills, and bam, that's it. You have managed to bout everything there is in the game. Oh, you want to play on full screen? Guess what? That doesn't work either because you get a lovely string not found error message. This message shows up several times because the game wasn't even finished before they decided to launch it. The only positive thing I can say about this game is the sound design is really good. The monsters sound like monsters, the ambient could potentially make a different game that wasn't this one scary. Unfortunately for Ever Design Design, he is stuck working with a shit game. Last thing we can rant about this for this game is the price point. Price is extremely important. The game needs to be affordable enough for people to buy your game. Without feeling like they are making a huge investment, especially when your company has never made a game before so people are unsure of your quality. This game is an insulting $17 of $17 for all of 15 minutes of content. This game has on the official website they said they worked with Valve to come together with this price point. I have no idea how they managed to think $17 would ever be acceptable for this. The game had two years of development at time and this is all we get. The flock gets a 2 out of 10, the concept was there but the execution was not.